Okay, there is the top. Just over from here, it's 800 meters to the top. And of course, they bypass this, which is the tunnel that the road, you know, that actually, obviously, the uh, cars go through. But for today, the cyclists get up here to finish. Fair to say that there is a fair bit happening down here. A little bit of music, a little bit of food, and a few beers, and a bit of wine being drunk. And this is the Galibier, the top of the Galibier. Quite a big grand dams, they're quite a big police presence sorting themselves out. Yep, that's a bit of snow. That is a bit of snow, there's the tunnel. There is generally quite a good buzz and atmosphere up here now. It's sort of approaching 3 o'clock, see the caravan come through in about another 40 minutes. And then of course, we're not going to see the riders till closer to 5 o'clock. Lots of time for people to hang out, have a few drinks, socialise, talk about the cycling and just take in the magnificent views. So the boys on tour from Norway? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, hence the, uh, the, the, the ones over there. So what do you want out of today's uh, little uh, gathering at the tour? Well, I hope uh, tour and as well with a peloton, not in the bus. Yeah, no, no, okay, but what do you guys, what, what do you want out of today? A lot of champagne. <laughs> a lot of champagne. Champagne. Yes. And find some some, some nice, uh, maybe some nice French girls. Yes, of course. Uh, hard, hard to find. If they're up here, uh, freezing. Yeah, have you found any yet? Uh, not yet, but they uh, will. Uh, We'll, uh, like the weekend flag. They'll be drawn to the flag. Yes, they will, they will. Okay, Absolutely. nice. Absolutely. So these boys on tour from Norway, looking like they're having a good time up here. If Galibier, drinking alcohol at two and a half thousand meters. It's got to be good for you. <laughs> Is it alcohol? I didn't no, know. it's... I didn't know. I'm, I'm sort of getting my head around it. Espressos, which are very small, and of course they don't have soy milk. So, I'm having to get me here around doing espressos, but it's very busy getting coffees at the top of Galibier. Alright, approaching sort of 3 o'clock, we're going to see the uh, caravan come through in about another 45 minutes and people are piling in here. TV and radio, a lot of behind the scenes stuff happening in here. A lot of various from France television. I've actually just run into um, someone from Australia television. Yes, but yes, they're actually investing some money, but a fair bit happening back behind here. Behind the scenes, this is upstairs here, behind, is this where all the radio hangs out, downstairs here is the television and as you can see caution work in progress a lot bunch of wires back here but this is all just behind it's happening here and a bunch of wires that someone's going to stand on and these guys were classic before a whole bunch of media arrived and started having a few uh well yeah alcoholic beverages in that little tent area for the photographers as well <laughs> yeah, photographers hanging out in this area and uh and you can see photographers <laughs> And we're on television screen with some of the footage. Uh, at this stage, 82 kilometers to go. Break up the road of five and a half minutes. The air is just a massive wires back here. I, fair to say, been back stage sort of area in a few New, New Zealand events and you'd never see this. And I'm just, it's just wires everywhere. And you've got to wonder, do they know where everything goes? Well, they seem to be putting out some television images, so. Um, Classic. Okay. This is a French. And this, i got to say, only in front. Apparently, it looks like a flower. And, uh, okay, this is where I'm going to go to the toilet out in the beautiful French fresh air. All right, I won't walk you through it when I'm actually physically doing this. But this is <laughs> an outside in the beautiful mountainside. French on the big screen. And this is going to be a key corner here. About 1200 meters from the finish line, and this is interesting this club tour de France sort of thing set up that's basically on the back of a massive truck. But obviously, they transport and build everywhere for the keys of the stage finishes, and of course, looking back up towards the finish line.